Hello, I am Nurul Athar, EMP, CPHIMS and ITR certified. In this presentation, I am going to explain what is the difference between electronic medical record and electronic health record EMR versus EHR. Some people use the term electronic medical record and electronic health record interchangeably but the difference between the two terms is actually quite significant. Let's see electronic medical records EMR EMR or digital version of paper charts in the clinician's office an EMR contains the medical and treatment history of the patient in one practice. Remember, one practice. EMR have advantage over paper records. For example, EMR allow clinician to okay, track data over time, easily identify which patients are due for preventive screening or checkups check how their patients are doing on certain parameters such as blood pressure, reading or vaccination. Monitor and improve overall quality of care within practice. Okay. But the information in EMRs doesn't travel easily out of the practice. In fact, patients record might even have to be printed out and delivered by mail to a specialist and other member of the care team. Okay. This diagram represents electronic medical record. Okay, how it's function. See? This is hospitals. Inside hospital there is the electronic medical record system. It's connected through internet network, doctors, use system, pathology, patients and pharmacist. Okay, all this information is stored in electronic medical record system. Okay, see. Remember, all identities belong to single organization or hospital in electronic medical record setup. Okay. Now we will explore electronic health records. Electronic health record or EHR refers to a system that go beyond simply providing an electronic form of medical records. Okay. This diagram represents okay. electronic medical record is subset of electronic health record. Okay. Okay. This diagram rep uh, shows how electronic medical record system works okay in EHR multiple medical professional manage data from multiple sources for same patients same patient can be managed by multiple hospital clinician for best and integrated treatment this is patients okay and how this patient interact with doctors pharmacy pathology okay this interconnected network, multiple hospitals, multiple doctors, multiple pharmacy, multiple pathology and insurance sectors. Okay. So we'll see now. An EHR is comprehensive health record and include the following. Interoperability, decision support and continuity of care. Let's see what is interoperability. The ability to exchange information with other source for, for example, to order laboratory test and integrate result directly into record. This is decision support. The ability to use information about the patient within an EHR in combination with external information such as diabetes care guidelines to guide the physician in patient care. Decision, okay. Oh, sorry, <laughs> to guide physician in patient care, decision supports can also include warning and alerts such as 
potential drug interaction during the prescription writing process. Now we will see continuity of care. The ability to exchange information and interface uh, patient clinical data with other healthcare providers such as hospital emergency departments or spe specialists and provide patient with their own health record. Okay, that brings us to end of my presentation. I hope you found this information useful.